Hey everyone, it's Mr. Flying Pig HD here. Cristiano Ronaldo has only gone and won the Ballon d'Or. Um, uh, yeah, of course he's bloody won the Ballon d'Or because he's blatantly the best player in the world this year. Do you know what I mean? Uh, anybody who thought otherwise, I mean, it's a lot of people just Messi fanboys, you know, wanted to give it to Lionel Messi. Well, you know, screw Lionel Messi, man. I mean, Messi's one of the best players in the world. You know, I say that mockingly because he's probably the best player in the world. But... Cristiano Ronaldo is also the best player in the world. So it's very tough. You know, my personal opinion about Cristiano Ronaldo is that if you put Cristiano Ronaldo at freaking Kettering Town or somewhere or Altrincham or, uh, you know, Bury or somewhere, he's going to, even with the bad players around him, he's going to create things for people. He is going to score goals individually on his, on his own more frequently than Messi. Not that Messi can't do that. We've all seen Messi absolutely destroy teams. But physically, I just don't think that... You know, Messi can even, you know, he can can even uh, compete with Ronaldo because Ronaldo's just a physical specimen. Messi's very good. He's got a low center of gravity. He's driven his best river I've seen. Um, you know, he's absolutely fantastic. But, you know, I just, I don't know. I've just got, in my personal opinion, Cristiano Ronaldo is that player. He's the complete player. You know what I mean? He can head the ball. He's tall. He can, he's got his ridiculous pace. He's got ridiculous control and skill. He can shoot from anywhere. He's amazing at free kicks. You know, I mean, there's not really anything you could say about Cristiano Ronaldo that you can say is, is, is really bad. Whereas Messi's got a couple of areas where he's at least mediocre in, do you know what I mean? Um, but anyway, this is, you know, this turned into a Messi versus Ronaldo debate here. But I just wanted to make a video about Cristiano Ronaldo winning the Ballon d'Or because I think he's the best player in the world. Um, and I've always been a fan of him, obviously, since Manchester United, where he was an absolute legend. And, uh, you know, over in uh, Spain, he's just been a complete revelation. 80 million euros or pounds, pounds, 80 million pounds they paid for him, um, which is a ridiculous amount of money. And at the time, it looked like you were like going, nobody's worth that much. But it seems cheap. It actually seems cheap now that he's gone there and he scored all those freaking goals. I believe he's, he's, he's currently on more than a goal a game average, which is just ridiculous. How can you do that? You know, over that such such a long period of time as well. It's He really is some player. Um now, that puts uh, Cristiano Ronaldo on two Ballon d'Ors. He won the other one at Man United. And um, Messi's currently on four. I personally think now, right, this may be a bit controversial, but I'm sure there was one year in there. I can't really remember, but I remember at the time being outraged that Cristiano Ronaldo didn't win it ahead of Messi. Um, I think it was the Euro, the, the year Ronaldo dragged Portugal to, uh, you know, quite far in the Euros and Messi just had a mare or, or didn't play. Into, I can't really remember. No, I don't think it was that year. But anyway, there was a year when uh, Cristiano Ronaldo deserved to win ahead of Messi and Messi won it. That was just my opinion, obviously. In my opinion, it's just that it doesn't really count for very much, to be honest with you. But that was my opinion. And, um, and uh, also another year, the World Cup year, South Africa 2010, I believe it was, um, when Spain won the World Cup and Barcelona won all that stuff. And yeah, okay, Lionel Messi, you know, he was the best player in the world in technically, but you also had Iniesta and, and Xavi and those players who were also like the best players in the world at that time. And considering that they won all the same stuff that Lionel Messi did, Lionel Messi went to another World Cup and didn't really, you know, produce again. And, um, you know, Spain won it and Iniesta scored in the final and all the, you know, all these factors in it just means that Iniesta or Xavi even, or probably Iniesta should have won it that year. Um, as well, so it should currently stand at three to Cristiano, and what's that? How many? Three? Yeah, three to no two to two to Lionel Messi, and then that it just leaves one to uh, yeah to Iniesta. That's how it should have been divided, my um, my friends. That's my personal opinion. What do you think? Do you talk? Um, do you think I'm talking absolute cod shit? It sounds in my head like I am. So yeah, but no, that's genuinely genuinely my opinion. So um, yeah, really happy Cristiano Ronaldo won the Ballon d'Or. Absolutely deserved it. And he's a quality player. Frank Ribery, mate. Frank Ribery, what? Uh, Iron Robin's better blatantly, isn't he? Do you know what I mean? What's Frank Ribery in there? No, fair play, whatever. But yeah, nice one, Frank. Jog on, son. Anyway, uh, Mr. Flying Pig HD here. What do you think about Cristiano Ronaldo winning the Ballon d'Or? Do you think it should have gone to Messi? Are you one of those Messi fanboys that I mentioned earlier? Are you happy that Cristiano Ronaldo won it? Um, let me know. I'm very interested to see, you know, the differences out there, what percentage of people would uh are glad that Ronaldo won it who think that Ronaldo should have won it for his uh, performances this season that kind of thing so awesome but anyway take it easy please like this video subscribe to my channel Mr Flying Pig HD you can subscribe by uh clicking this little badge up here which takes you to um 
my channel page you can click subscribe or I believe you can just go down here and it says subscribe there and you can subscribe that shit that's right but anyway thanks for watching take it easy let me know what you think and peace